I was speaking uh, just recently at the largest IT conference in Hong Kong, and the excitement wasn't about software as a service. We already got that. They were talking about uh, collaboration as a service. They were talking about networking as a service. They were talking about innovation as a service. As a matter of fact, software as a service is written capital S, small a, a, S, software as a service. What's the one I want you to think about? X, A, A, S. And what's that? Everything is a service. Country of Singapore just put the government of Singapore in the cloud. And it's more secure now than it was before. And they can deliver services at a less expense than they could have before. Um, I was just uh, a couple of months ago meeting with the CIOs of every government agency in the United States. And they were crying over sequestration, how their hours are cut, and they were all pissed and upset. They were in crisis mode. Singapore was in opportunity mode. Do they have access to the same technology? The answer is yes. It's not the tool, it's how you use it. It's the mindset. What do we do when we virtualize IT? We continue to take heavy hardware and software and put it to the cloud with more security. By the way, when you've got Raytheon and you've got uh, other defense contractors like Raytheon, including Lockheed Martin, two clients of mine, I can guarantee you that a couple of years ago they thought, we can't use the cloud, it's not secure. Today, their top people realized it's more secure. In other words, there's been a shift, there's been something that's happened. It's making us have to look at the cloud a little bit differently. And how does that affect us? And the answer is it affects you and your clients in a big way.